All right, Shalom. Shalom, I'm the brother Ha'amayan at the Great Millstone, Columbus, Georgia camp. And first of all, I want to say Shalom and Kao Halayim La Yahweh Bashem Awa Shai Bashem Rakakadash. Hey, I'll praise to Yahweh Bashem Awa Shai Bashem Rakakadash. Okay, double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone that teach and rule well and labor in 100% doctrine. I learned this truth from according to the Bible. Okay, shalom to the hopeful elect pushing this truth and our righteousness and its sincerity around the four winds of the earth. And to the sincere believers in a few aquaf, I would like to say shalom. I'm the brother Ha'amayan. And on today, I got this, uh, I got this, uh, I was watching a little BMF show and, um, Lord willing down, scribe the lesson because. This is this is not for uh, monetary gain. So the fair use act, I will be using. I'm not copywriting anything. This is only for educational purposes, right? So here I have this video, and um, Snoop Snoop Dogg is the the, the 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 pastor or whatnot. But it says, let me let me play it real quick. One God, one faith, and one baptism. What is God's name? You hear that? They said, what is God's name, right? What is God's name? That's wrong, man. And that's what's wrong with our people, man. They they think of uh, Yahweh and Yahweh Shah are the same. But they incorrectly called the Lord God and a Serapis Christos. Amen. Jesus Christos. Jesus Christ. That's not the damn Lord name. It's like it. That's not our Lord damn name, man. The Lord name is Yahweh Shai. Yahweh Bahasham Yahweh Shai. Yahweh being the Heavenly Father and Yahweh Shai being the only begotten Son, man. And they're watching you, man. Profane, profanely, uh, Commit wickedness, man. Because y'all know what's up, man. Y'all know what's going on. A lot of Jakes know the truth, man. A lot of Jakes know the Lord's name. Okay? So, hey, y'all. Uh, let me, uh. Brian got the blue letter. This won't be quick. I'm going to get straight to the point. Just showing you how there's, there are two different entities. They just want, they don't, they don't, they want a cord, though, man. All right. This is Matthew chapter 10, verse 32. Whosoever therefore shall confess me before men, him will I confess also before my father, which is in heaven. Letting you know, man, guess what? That Yahweh, the heavenly father sitting on the throne, right? The ancient of days. Okay. The om omnipotent, omnipotent. And you have Yahweh Shahu sitting on the right hand side. Matter of fact, man. Hey, I'm gonna bring out a precept when I when I get done with this. Matthew 10 and 33. But whosoever shall deny me before me and him will I also deny before my father, which is in heaven. Letting you know. My heavenly father and my father, right? My heavenly father and my father. Okay, you keep seeing that, man. Matthew chapter 12 and verse Matthew chapter 12 and verse 47. Let's start at verse 46. While he yet talked to the people, behold, his mother and his brethren stood without desiring to speak with him. Then one said unto him, Behold, thy mother. Thy brethren stand without desiring to speak with thee. But he answered and said unto him that told him, Who is my mother and who are my brethren? And he stretched forth his hand towards his disciples and said, Behold, meaning, look, this is my mother, this is my brother, for whosoever shall do the will of my father, which is in heaven, the same as my brother, my sister, and my mother, man. Let you know the Lord always gave reverence back to his heavenly father, man. 
Yahweh, right? It's not hard to get. It's just a stumbling block to the ones the Lord didn't give it to. That's it, man. So, with that being said, let's get uh, <clears throat> let's get. I'm gonna get Proverbs chapter thirty and verse four, right? Who have ascended up into heaven or descended? Who have gathered the wind in his fists? Who have a who have bound the waters in a garment? Who have established all the ends of the earth? What is his name and what is his son's name? If thou can tell, what is his name, the heavenly Father, and what is his son's name? It ain't no oh uh, that Trinity doctrine, man. That's what's wrong, man. Hey, our people have been false indoctrinated, drunken of that wine of the devil, which is Esau, Edom, man. Okay. And that's the spirit, man. Hey, the time up there say 1044, 1448, man. Uh, um, let's get Colossians chapter 3, I want to see. Yeah, verse 1. And this is the point, verse 1. According to this lesson I'm making, listen to verse 1. It says, If ye then be risen with Hamashiach, which is Yahweh Shah, seek those things which are above. Where Hamashiach sitteth on the right hand of the Heavenly Father, man. Okay. I had this uh, lesson. Uh, I wouldn't say I was pondering on it. I just supposed to did it. But the Spirit led me elsewhere a couple days ago. Uh, but yeah, man. I was just thinking like, dang. Make a quick lesson about this, man. Because our people got it twisted, bro. It's, it's the Heavenly Father. And um, <clears throat> uh, our Lord and Savior. Matter of fact, let me get that. Um, dang, what's that scripture in Corinthians? Um, that every every head. Bear with me. Hey, the Wadi how about shot? First Corinthians eleven and first Corinthians eleven and three. Let you know, watch this. But I will have you know that the head of every man is Hamashiach, Yahweh Shah, and the head of the woman is the man. We above our women, right? Who is above us? Yahweh Shah. It says, and the head of Hamashiach is Yahweh, the Heavenly Father. See? There you have it, man. So, Lord willing, this was an edifying lesson. I would like to close out by giving all glory, honor, infinite praises unto Yahweh, Bahashom, Yahweh Shai, Bahashom, Rechah HaKadash. Double honors to the apostles and elders, a great millstone that teach and rule well, and labor in 100% doctrine, hard learning this truth from according to the Bible. Shalom to the hopeful elect pushing his truth and our righteousness and the sincerity around the four winds of the earth. To the sensitive believers in the few off waff, I would like to say shalom. Babakusha, babakusha, bababa, kwame asharala, barak kal akim. Shalom.